We've got a cement culver here. It's about this big around, and we've got four colony traps in there. And I've never set this before. There's some rat sign in here. I don't see any houses, but I'm positive there's rats in here. So um, let's see what we got. All right, we're forming a little ice. I have no clue what we're going to have here, but I am somewhat optimistic. We'll take our dive uh, material off there. And well, that one was put there as part of the dive materials. Oh, we got nothing. Hmm. Well, we've got two in there. Let's see, are they diving deeper into the two bottom ones? This will tell us. If we don't have any more, I'm pulling these because it's freezing up. Well, there's, there's one more. That makes three. This one feels kind of heavy. Oop, slipping away. Oh, they're kind of jammed in there. We got four in there. Four, seven total. That's a pretty good catch. It's a one night check. So, I'm gonna pull these because it's getting so darn cold. If we had had 10 or more, I would have kept it in, and this could produce for a few more checks, but I'm going to pull it. But I want to show you just how they squeeze into this thing. Now, the, there was no room for this to go up anymore, for that door. This door, coming from the other way, it could have gone up some, and it, apparently, I shouldn't say apparently, but they may have been coming from the other way. Maybe that's where most of the rats are denning over there. But this one, conceivably, on an extreme condition, on an extreme, maybe a two-day check, you could get three more rats into here because they will continue to push that door open. They'll just push and they'll try digging and that's the nature of rats. They will just burrow their way, way through. So, um, seven rats. I'm happy with that, and they look like they're decent size rats, too. There's one that's a little small. We'll get them out. Check another colony trap. And these are collapsible traps, so we'll uh, collapse them down. Okay. Weeby Knives, voted one of Field & Stream's best hunting products. Every Weeby Knife comes with up to 24 wicked sharp replacement blades. After all, it's a Weeby. Order your Weeby Knife today with up to 24 free replacement blades at WeebyKnives.com. Well, we got us a culvert here and the muskrats are going through it in a really effective way. To utilize these is a colony trap. These particular colony traps are collapsible. And we're going to put two of them in here just to cover the bases. And uh, these are effective beyond belief, really. Um, the muskrats will hit these and push the door open. And that's sitting just a tad too far below the water. The thing is, the culverts, they vary in sizes and what's on the bottom. But the beauty of this set is, it's going to freeze up tighter than your drum in the next 24 hours, according to the weather reports. And these are going to remain effective until the ice gets down far enough. We want those doors so they open freely. 
So some of these muskrats may walk across the top of this. So we're gonna fix that. We're gonna put some stuff on top. A beaver trapper calls these dive sticks. That's what they're gonna do. They're gonna dive. These are gonna have some muskrats in them tomorrow. I have no doubt about it. None whatsoever. What are you doing over there, Juno? Did you shut my door? Okay, that is one deadly set right there. Super deadly. Okay, I don't know if this will pick up on the camera, but there's a run right out almost in the center of this thing. And I'm probably gonna muddy it up once I get in there. We just have a small a five by five colony trap set out there because it's not a wide run. And it's going to be interesting to see what we have because there's a muskrat swimming around here taunting us and so this is a hard bottom and so I'll muddy it up but it'll take just a few minutes to get real muddy and sometimes you're just going by feel and in this case the run gets a little wider I can see better today and I should have shoved it in a little further. But let's see what we have. Holy cow. All right, this five by five has four, four muskrats. So there's at least one more in here and that's the way it's gonna stay. These are all fairly small muskrats, and a muskrat, they'll, they'll breed up to three times in a year. They'll ha I have up to three litters, and in some cases, the, the baby muskrats will have a litter. That's how quick they can, they can populate. And these are all smaller ones here. And so at the, these were born later in the year. There's no doubt about that. And, um, so I don't know if I'll, how many of them I'll keep, we'll get them out. And, but that's a pretty good catch. It's a real nice catch.